we've seen you, what, about two or three times after your surgery? Joan Osborne is a trailblazer. At 73 years old, she was the first person in southwest Florida to undergo a kidney operation using the Da Vinci robotic surgical system. And I knew I was the first one, but I trusted him. Joan underwent a pileoplasty, which is surgery to reconstruct a malformed or obstructed ureter. Her condition was painful and problematic. You know, when you and urinate and everything, and sometimes I felt like I needed to and I couldn't. The best way I can explain it is the kidney produces urine and then the urine drains down into the bladder through the uh, um, uh, ureter. And when there is a stricture or uh, some form of blockage, uh, that doesn't happen properly and needs to be repaired. Joan opted for robotic surgery because it's less invasive than other methods and offers a quicker recovery time. Using a few small holes, the Da Vinci robot was able to remove the obstructive segment and sew the ends together while her surgeon was operating the controls just a few feet away. And the ability to move your hands as if you're inside the patient simply using an instrument. And that's what it's all about. Up to now, the Da Vinci surgical robot was used in cardiac, gynecological, and prostate procedures. Kidney surgery marks the next step in using it for delicate, complex operations. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.